Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to another mob battle. In today's fight is going to be the Monk King from the Better Dungeons mod against the Iron Golem. And yeah, you guys have been requesting this dude for a while. It is his first time entering the arena. It is like a giant monkey with 1,500 hit points. I mean, that is pretty ridiculous. The Iron Golem only has 100. So we're going to have to see what happens with this. But the thing is, he actually has pretty low defense. So he takes a lot of damage when he is attacked. So be sure to leave a comment and let me know who you think is going to win this battle. And we will get it started right now. Good luck, Iron Golem. That dude has like 15 times more health than you. And yeah, he swings his arm around. He like knocks mobs into the air and sometimes like underneath the ground, which you will see. Luckily for the Iron Golem, he takes no fall damage. So he has a chance here. He is down to 65. And the Monk King has already taken almost 200 damage. He's like banging him in the head and knocking him under the ground. It's pretty funny. He is down to 30. Launched super high into the air. And yeah, some other mobs would take tons of fall damage fighting him, but not the Iron Golem. He is down to 9. And one more hit here. He is dead. So yeah, the Monk King has won the first round, but he seriously took over 300 damage. I mean, that is a lot. So what we're going to do is try two on one against him. All right, guys, it is time for round two. Two Iron Golems against the Monk King. And if you guys haven't noticed, he has a really similar fighting style to the Mutant Iron Golem, swinging his arms around. He has a couple other moves he hasn't used yet where he like jumps into the air and does like this explosive thing. Oh, they're both flying right now. And he is down to 1,200 already. He really does take a lot of damage. All right, they are down to 37 and can't tell the other one. Whoa, they threw him up there. He's down to 881 already. They're both still alive. They might actually have a chance here. This one is down to 23 and he just like jumped all over the place right there. Yeah, that's like his other move. He like goes up in the air, does like this explosive thing and kind of goes all over the place. He's down to 455. One Iron Golem is almost dead. There's only one left alive. He's down to two. And the Mun King was able to win. So what we're going to do is try three on one against him. And I actually think he might lose in that round. Here we go, guys. Three on one against the Mun King. And yeah, he is really going to struggle here. They do so much damage. I mean, Iron Golems only have 100 health, but they really deal out damage very quickly. He's like jumping all over the place. They're charging into him. Oh, he hit all three at the same time. That is a big advantage. I mean, seven damage to every single one of them. And he has been launched. And he kind of like jumped to the side there once he went into the air. He is down to 1,100. Who is going to win? I think this one's going to be really close. The Iron Golems, they're struggling a little bit here. They're down to about 70 each. Oh, and he hit them all again. Yeah, that's going to be his chance. If he can keep doing that when he swings his arm around, hit every single one. I really think he can win. Actually, he's like really low right now. Never mind. Just ignore what I just said. He's down to 68. He's about to die. Oh, and they've killed him. Wow. The Iron Golems have won all three left alive. That is crazy. I think we need to try three on one one more time just to see, though. All right, guys. We're going to give three on one one more shot. I mean, the Monk King deserves one more chance. Maybe he could do it. Swing his arm around. He's got to hit them all at the same time here to win this. There he goes. It's a good shot right there. Yeah, they seem to kind of just swing him around randomly, just like the Mutant Iron Golem does. But this dude is nowhere near as strong as the Mutant Iron Golem. And he is flying through the air right there. His explosion didn't really hit anything. He is down to 721 and going down quick. I don't know if he has a chance. 65. I'm checking their health. They're all around like 50 or 60. And he is down to 560. I've never seen a mob with this much health die so fast. That one is stuck under the ground. I feel bad for the Iron Golem. He's like, what the hell do I do here? I don't think it's going to matter, though. Because the Monk King is about to die. And they are victorious once again. And they're cheering, as you can see. They're, they're very happy. This one is not cheering. I Honestly, bro, I can understand why you're not. Probably because you're stuck underneath the ground. So, guys, I was planning on going into larger battles, and it looks like it's not possible with this mod, which I'm going to show you guys right now. The Monk Kings are actually so aggressive that they will fight each other. I don't know why. They're the only mobs I've ever seen do that before. Um, so what we're going to do is try maybe another two-on-one, see if the Iron Golems can actually win that one. Because, yeah, this is definitely not supposed to happen. And they even tend to knock each other underneath the ground and get completely stuck, which is pretty crazy. So guys, what I'd hate to do is make a really short battle just because we can't do a giant one. We can try two on one again though. 
I mean, they did so good three on one. I feel like they actually have a chance in the two on one. We give them one more shot. Come on, Iron Golems. You can do this. Just launch him into the air like that. And maybe they will actually win. I mean, he takes so much damage. It's ridiculous. He's down to 1,200. The Iron Golems are getting launched. This one is down to 79. And the other one, 72. As I said, he has like the lowest defense in the world. So he goes down really quick. He's down to 935. And the Iron Golems are half dead. I think it's going to be really close this time. I don't know who's going to win. This one at 51. I think they're both. Oh, one at 44. They have a chance here. He's down to 700. Come on, Iron Golems. You can win this. And if they win, I will give him one more chance to see who is like the winner in the two-on-one here. He's swinging his arms around. He has like the craziest moves. Oh, and he killed them both. Oh, man. The Monkey just puts up too strong of a fight in the two-on-one. So obviously the Iron Golems just can't win this two-on-one. But what we're going to do is try two Iron Golems and me against the Monk King. I think we could do it as a team, guys. We are going to win this. I'm going to be fighting with the Monk King sword. And I have full Iron Gear on. So it should be interesting. I'm going to spawn him in like right there. You guys go for him. I'm kind of afraid at this point. All right. So I'm going to try to come from the side here and help them win this. Get him right here. Come on. Die. Die, Monk King. Oh, God. So yeah, this sword, I think, is pretty powerful. I mean, the thing is, he takes so much damage whenever you hit him. All right, we can do this. We can win it. This one is down to, oh, God, 45 and 62. My allies. My allies. It's actually really easy to avoid his attacks because he's, he's not very intelligent. He's down to 650. We can win this. Oh, God, he launched me. Like, right after I said that, too. Oh, we're going to win. We're going to win. He's down to 297. Avoid that. Oh, God. Oh, one iron golem is dead. Last one alive with me here. And, oh my god, he's down to 64. I'm going to win it. I'm going to win it for you guys. I'll avenge you. He's down to 23. This is so close. And he is dead. It looks like we won together, although it was really close. I mean, both Iron Golems died. But anyways, guys, today, the Monk King has won the battle against the Iron Golems. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. And if you have an idea for a mob battle, leave it in the comments. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time.